I come on back and Tom said, well, what do you think? And he said, you don't want to go in the, in the courts. You don't want to do this. You and Laurent, uh, Lou and Wendy, you really? don't want to go through this, do you? Is that bad? So I said, no, Tom. He said, right, you talk with Wendy and Fred. Because he got to talk with who the other person was. And, and Lorraine came as well. So the four of us were talking. And we discussed, so the idea was to sell sell that house not for a couple of days I'll give her some money to go and um, get another house and she could have the children be sublime and then we'll go from there and that's what we did. Yeah. Yeah. so yeah. honest dude I'm so we did there was no fighting you, yeah. nothing oh my god and we broken apart we got married too young so at the end of the same day. dude I, I was married at 19 yeah I was married at 24 I, I told many people. she was only 18 I won't tell many people yeah. that I was married at 19 and someone told me that hey Trendy, do you know that some your girlfriend was doing something with someone else? Yeah. I went, no. Um, he said, have a DNA test with that. Come on, it's my kid. <laughs> anyway, I had a DNA test and it came back from DNA Laboratories in, in Victoria. 99% sure it was my kid. And I wouldn't have done it, apart from someone telling me that they thought that someone slept with my wife at the time, just yeah. she got pregnant. Unbelievable, but it changed my whole life. Yeah, it changed my life. You don't know what it's like to have a baby born in front of your eyes that you love with all your heart, and it's not your kid. When you find out it's not your kid, it hurts. It's fucking crazy, dude. It's fucking crazy. You know? well, I, I found the same thing with my first wife. I found out three weeks before we got married, I had a wedding. Yeah. I found out that she, all right, she was a secretary. She moved from 